Well, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, folks. Thank you for uh, joining us today to hear us talk about Adobe Acrobat 10 and 3D in PDF with Tetra 4D. My name is Joel Geraci, and I'm the technical evangelist uh, here at Adobe for Acrobat. And I'm joined by uh, Craig Drunchen, uh, who is the chief technology officer of Tetra 4D. And as you guys are aware, we announced Acrobat 10 uh, just a couple of weeks ago. And uh, it's actually available now as of uh, Monday. You can download the trial version of Acrobat on Windows and try it out for yourself. Uh, one of the things that we changed in this last version is we removed some of the abilities to convert uh, 3D files into PDF files. And that's going to be the main thrust of the discussion today. Before we get started, though, I'd like to switch over to a couple of polling questions and see what versions of Acrobat you guys have. Uh, I can see already there are a few of you who are using Adobe Acrobat 10. And uh, good for you guys. Hopefully you were in the pre-release program, but you already may have uh, downloaded or purchased um, a version for yourself, so good for you. The majority of people are on Acrobat 9. And most of you have either Pro or Pro Extended. I'm assuming those of you that are on Pro Extended are the ones that have uh, version 9. So uh, thank you for chiming in those, on those polls. And I'll jump right over into the main portion of the presentation. Uh, before I begin sharing my screen, I do want to point out that this meeting is being recorded. And a version of it will be posted for you to look at this uh, at another time, or send links to your friends and coworkers and things like that. Uh, we will not be posting the slides, however. So just the, the complete set of content, which is a recording of this meeting, will be made available. Additionally, uh, throughout the presentation, you can submit questions to our presenters, as well as myself. And um, we will do our best to answer them uh, for you right here live. And at the end of the presentation, will also be I'll be reading questions from the chat pod out live, and Craig will be able to answer them at that time. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, begin sharing my screen, and we will start the presentation. And here we go. Uh, so that's our uh, just our introductory slide here. And what I want to talk about for just the next couple minutes, really cover this very quickly, is why we decided to uh, change our strategy around 3D PDF creation. Uh, mostly what uh, went on is what we needed were the real industry experts to create the translation tools and really keep up with the latest 3D uh, technologies out there. So there are many companies out there that have uh, competing technologies. And it really became very difficult to, for Adobe to update those converters in a very, very timely manner. And typically, that's what's required in that industry. So what we did is we went out and we researched uh, some of our, our partners who would have already been dealing with, and we found the, the real industry expertise, who has a very, very strong commitment to 3D technologies. Uh, and that ended up being uh, Tetra 4D. So they are now taking over the technology for us. They're highly focused on uh, 3D. And we formed a very strong strategic partnership with them. And this uh, e-seminar is really the beginning of that partnership. It's really the first event that we have launched. Um, with this new partnership in place. So there will be uh, special deals that come out of this partnership. So please stay tuned at the end of this, uh, and you'll see how you can uh, take your version of Acrobat Pro, uh, Acrobat 10 Pro, and be able to add in all of the 3D capabilities that you are used to having in Pro Extended. So uh, one thing I do want to be sure to point out is that while we have removed the ability to convert 3D files into PDF files, Adobe is completely committed 
to the 3D manufacturing and AEC marketplace. And uh, the important part there is we really focus on the viewers. We supply the uh, underlying technology for uh, PRC, which uh, is an emerging standard for um, 3D viewing technology. We supply the free Adobe Reader along with all of the measuring uh, tools.